Sharks' first trip inside the Chiefs' 22. Let's see what they can do from it. Ben Curry leading the side on his return and leading with setting a good example there. And there's a chance for Aflati to go out wide. Robert was waiting. Tom Aflati, another man formerly of the Chiefs, of course, like Luke Cowan Dickey. Who prepares to receive here potentially from Gus War. Now it goes to Cobus Visa first. In goes War again to Ilangi. Off lows to Curry. Oh, that's strong, really strong. Ships it out to Ford. Ford onto Robuck off the wing. And that is what Sale have not been doing often enough this season. When they're in the 22, seizing the chance. Really nice line-out take from Jupria, started it off, bit of deception at the line-out, Dugdale, Dugdale just on, one carry, one clean break, why not? But what there was from Sale here was accuracy and power there from Curry, straight over the top of Stu Townsend, that doesn't happen too often, but there's options and they've got power, lovely stuff from Sale, really nice. It's all about the uh, sale drive here, and it's very, very impressive. Second try, and look who scored it. The man that used to play in that Chiefs pack. Chiefs stayed down on the floor so as to not have a lifting pod in the air when Sale wanted to drive that mall, but they didn't do enough on landing. Sale got the nudge straight away. Exeter have got to do so much better. They've given such cheap territory to Sale to allow them into that position of the field. Cowan Dickey, look at that skill. On to Jean-Luc Dupria. Down it goes to War, on to uh, Rob Dupria. Hands from Carpenter are good to find Robert. Inside it goes to Rob, on it goes to War. War has got a player outside, but he is going to score himself. And that is a high quality score. Sale Sharks. Showing some of the best of the Premiership, and that is a very high bar, by the way. Total domination backed up on the scoreboard. A win and a win with a try bonus, which would seem to be the favourite here, because Roebuck is the favourite in the air, across the ground, and he's a favourite in the stands as well. They love him. Big moment in this second half. Not quite sure what Townsend's doing, waiting for that. Just invites Robach to jump on. It's the difference between an outside back and a scrum half potentially in that area, but Townsend, Stu Townsend needs to do better. But Robach is incredibly athletic. We see him do it this time and time again. Skinner going wide to Fairwabosa, who's got the space that he and his supporters have been craving. That is what he can do. Beyond 15. Another carry from Curry. Massive carry. For a massive presence in this south side. The Curry boys. One of them fit at the moment, Ben. His quirk to Curry, he's looking to release all the time. Hands away! Even in the heavy traffic like that, you could see his scanning of the situation. Off goes Quirk. That's what he loves to do as well, to show that to his supporters. The electric run from Rafi Quirk. It's what you want from a replacement nine, the energy, look at him. Apoku Fujor has come on and he can carry nice. just like that. Here's Dupree, we've seen some fantastic rugby. Robert's got his hat trick now, put it down. He does. Last year's finalists are desperate to stay in this title, Jace. Really nicely worked. Chief shredded in this instance. And it will end with Sale Sharks. Big winners, when they knew they had to win. Realistically, it was one of those no option days for sale. If you don't want to miss out on any of the Gallagher Premiership action, subscribe now.